Welcome back to the channel, everyone. So May 7th at the T-Mobile Arena, Canelo Alvarez versus Dimitri Bivol at 175 pounds for the lightweight championship of the world. Canelo is stepping up once again in weight class. We got to commend him for that. It's a brave move. Bivol is an excellent fighter, although not a huge power puncher, more of a great boxer than he is a power puncher. And that's why I think Canelo took this fight. To put it simply, I think he's got a better chance with Bivol winning a decision. The judges are going to side with him unless he gets stopped or unless he gets really beaten badly, like something like nine rounds to three or eight rounds to four. Other than that, it's going to be hard to beat Canelo on points. And I think a guy like Better Biev, because of his power, would have been a much tougher matchup for Canelo, at least at this weight class, 175, because these boys have big power. But in the end, you got to commend him for taking the fight. He is moving up. Bivol is a much taller guy. He's a naturally bigger guy. And uh, props to Canelo. How it's going to play out? I think it's going to go to a decision. I, I think Bivol has a lot of skill, but I don't see the judges giving him a decision unless he clearly wins the fight. Meaning, you know, if he'd win two-thirds of the rounds, something like that. So it's going to be tough for Bivol to come out of this one with the win. But what I do... What I do like to see is Canelo's confidence building and then him going after Better BF to become undisputed. I don't think he beats Better BF. I think he gets stopped and uh, nothing taken away from him, but it's that's another level of fighter altogether. Anyway, May 7th, Bivol versus Canelo. What do you guys think? How does it go down? Who wins it? How do they win it? How many rounds? Is it a stoppage or a decision? Let me know in the comments below. Like, comment, subscribe.